Hey everyone, and welcome back to my channel. Alright, so I was requested to film this video, the TMI tag, and I honestly fucking think I filmed this already. I was looking through the questions and I was like, I filmed this already, but I can't fucking find it on my channel, the video, so I'm pretty sure I filmed it, pretty sure I uploaded it, and then I'm pretty sure I deleted it because I deleted a bunch of my videos that I just really wasn't happy with. Um, the quality, how I was in them. I kept all of my piercing videos up, um, even though, let me fucking tell you, some of them make me cringe. I'm like, what the fuck? Like, were you thinking, like, writing that or that background or <laughs> what have you? Um, but anyway, so I'm just gonna refilm this video. And so, TMI tag, I have the questions on my phone here, and I'm just gonna answer them, read them and answer them as fast as I can because I have other stuff I need to be doing. So, question one, what are you wearing? I am wearing this cute shirt. This is a Galaxy Cat, the Galaxy Unicorn shirt. Super cool, and then you guys can't see, but I'm just wearing sweatpants and then socks. Uh, number two, ever been in love? Yes, I am currently in love. Number three, ever had a terrible breakup? I think everyone pretty much has, um, so yeah. Number four, how tall are you? I am either 5'5 five five or 5'6. Five so I like to say 5'5, five five, but I'm probably 5'6. I am on the taller ratio of being a female. Um, number five, how much do you weigh? I'm not going to say. Uh, number six, any tattoos? Yes, I have two tattoos. You guys probably seen the one I have on this side of my shoulder and a lot of my videos. And then I have a Cocapelli turtle on this side of my stomach rivular kind of area. Uh, number seven, any piercings? I think we all know I got some piercings. <laughs> Obviously. Um, number eight, OTP, I don't know. Number nine, favorite show. Favorite show, favorite show. I don't really have a favorite show at the moment, but I've really been enjoying watching, uh, well, re-watching Flash, because I've already seen all the episodes. Um, re-watching Arrow. Um, Legend, what is that show, like, Legends of Tomorrow, it's another, like, superhero DC show, I like those, Supernatural, I fucking love Supernatural, um, and Ghost Hunters, um, alright, uh, favorite band, number 10, I don't really have favorite bands, um, I'm not that kind of person who has, like, favorite bands, um, there's bands I like, but I don't like a favorite one, I like Paramore, I like Five Finger Death Punch, I like Marilyn Manson, is he a band or is he a singer, let me know, um, I like Nirvana, I like Guns N' Roses, um, but then I like really, really, like really sounding shit too. Just kind of all over the place. Um, Alright, number 11, something you miss. Right off the top of my head, my cat Ferg comes to mind. She passed away like over a year ago. Um, she got bit by a skunk and got rabies. And that's, it's a typical Ferg way to go. Her name was Ferg. Um, Ferguson was her full name, but Ferg, what's her nickname? She was a very badass cat, and she was blind in one eye, but she could still hunt, and she would try to fight any animal. She was a real badass, but yeah. Absolutely miss her, um, yeah. Alright, number 12, favorite song? I don't have one. 13, how old are you? I am 21, but in less than a month, I guess, I will be 22. Uh, zodiac sign? Zodiac sign. Is that like Virgo? I'm a Virgo. Is that a zodiac sign? I'm spacey. <laughs> um, number 15. Quality you look for in a partner. Um, I would have to say loyalty, that's a big one. Um, being mature, that's very important, and I don't want somebody who's clingy. Um, 16. Favorite quote? <laughs> um, probably just the one that comes to me right off the top of my head is everything happens for a reason. I really like that one because I just feel like everything bad in my life happened for a reason and set me up to be a better person, to continue my journey, you know, and I don't know, just make me a better person and make me stronger and so I don't really regret any bad things that happened to me in the past um, because like I said, everything happens for a reason. Alright, number 17, favorite actor. I don't really have a favorite actor. Um, I mean, there's actors I like, I like, and I enjoy seeing them in their movies, but I don't really have a favorite one. Um, 18, favorite color, black or purple? Uh, 19, loud music or soft? Soft if I'm not in the gym, loud if I'm in the gym. Uh, 20, where do you go when you're sad? <laughs> to the gym. 
Um, or to bed. It kind of depends. Uh, 21. How long does it take you to shower? Anywhere from 15 to 30 minutes. Uh, 22. How long does it take you to get ready in the morning? Um, well, I'm a stay-at-home girlfriend, so I don't really have to, like, get up and get ready to go to work or school or anything like that, but when I was in school, it would take me anywhere from, like, an hour to two hours because I was that bitch that, like, put in, like, so much effort into how she looked. Um, if I'm getting ready to film, it usually takes me an hour, an hour and a half. It just kind of depends on what I want to do with my hair and my makeup. Uh, let's see. Which one was that? All right, number 23. Ever been in a physical fight? Yes, once when I was, well, I guess that's not true, but I'm only going to talk about one time. And it was when I was young and there was a little neighbor girl. I mean, her didn't like each other. And um, yeah, we ended up getting in a fight. And to this day, I don't even remember her name. I just know that she didn't like me and I didn't like her. Um, 24, turn on loyalty, uh, 25, turn off disloyalty, 26, the reason I joined YouTube, alright, I need to take a breath, I've been, like I said, I'm trying to answer these fast, um, alright, so the reason I joined YouTube, I joined YouTube for a variety of different reasons, there was no one solid reason as to why I joined, um, I wanted to do makeup tutorials, that was my goal, I love makeup and I just wanted to do a bunch of makeup tutorials. Um, but I also wanted to do piercing videos because even though I'm not a professional piercer and I never claim to be a professional piercer, I feel like I have a lot of knowledge when it comes to piercings and I was seeing a lot of bad piercing videos. They were giving me up like very bad advice. Um, you know, and you know, people who weren't professional piercers saying like, oh, well, send me pictures of your piercing and I can tell you what's wrong with it or something. Like, you're not a professional. You can't really sit there and tell somebody what's wrong with their piercing. When somebody comes to me and they're asking me what's wrong with their piercing, I give them my advice, but I always say, like, go to your piercer, go to a professional reputable piercer who can actually tell you what's wrong with your piercing. Um, but yeah, there's just a lot of bad piercing videos out there and I wanted to bring some actual facts and knowledge into the scenario, I guess. Um, I remember this one, it was when I was researching dip dimple piercing videos, and I, um, this girl, she was showing like how she makes her sea salt solution soak for cleaning them. So far, the video, I was like, okay, like it's not horrible, it's not like great, but it's not horrible. And then she was showing what she used to mix the um, salt and the water together, and it was a pimple blackhead extractor tool, um, and that really grossed me out, and that was one of the reasons why I was like, mm, I, I need to make, like, videos, um, because I knew, I knew I was gonna get my dimples pierced, I knew I was gonna get my nipples pierced, I, like, I knew I was getting all these piercings, like, I just knew, um, I'd set my mind to it, so I just knew, and so I just wanted, you know, to share some knowledge, I guess, um, and then I think I wanted people to connect to. I'm not a very sociable person, um, and I try not to use it as a crutch, and I try my best to be as sociable as I can be, um, but I wanted people to connect to, and I wanted people to talk to, and I absolutely love that YouTube has <laughs> given me that opportunity. Um, you know, I absolutely love talking to you, all of you guys. I love replying to all of you guys, whether it's here on Instagram or on Snap. I absolutely love it. Um, so yeah, those are like, the main reasons why I joined YouTube. All right, number 27, fears, spiders. I hate, hate, hate spiders so fucking much. All right, 28, last thing that made you cry. <laughs> like, honestly, almost anything makes me cry. I'm just that bitch, I guess. Um, if I'm laughing, I'm crying. Like, it. I'm just kind of a mess like that, I guess. Um, uh, 29, last time you said you love somebody, um, my boyfriend was getting ready to leave for work, or I guess when he was leaving, Go to work, whatever. Um, 30. Meaning behind your YouTube name. Alright, so my YouTube name, Native Beauty. Well, I wanted initially I wanted to have a YouTube channel that was just like all beauty related. Maybe like piercing videos here and there, because that is something that I'm interested in. Um and so I but I wanted it to reflect who I am, which is native, and that's something I'm so fucking incredibly proud to be. Um, and so I wanted, like, a username to reflect that, and so that's how Native Beauty came, I, I guess. Um, let's see. 31, last book you read. <sighs> last book I read. I don't, 
I don't remember, to be honest with you. I used, I used to like read books all the time, but I don't have new books to read, so I haven't really been reading books. Um, 32, the book you're currently reading. I'm not reading a book currently. Uh, 33, last show you watched, it was Destination um, Unknown or Destination Truth. One of those two. Um, 34, last person you talked to. If my cat doesn't count, then my boyfriend. Um... 35, the relationship between you and the last person you texted. He's my boyfriend. <laughs> uh, 36, favorite food. It depends. Um, breakfast food is biscuits and gravy. Um, dinner food, it's fast food, Chinese food. Love it. Um, dessert, it's the cheesecake that I make. I make bomb ass fucking homemade from scratch cheesecake. Like everything about the fucking cheesecake is like made from scratch. I don't do that, no bake shit, I make everything from scratch, like the crust, everything, and it's fucking delicious. And I'm not just saying that because I make it, like, other people tell me that all the time. Um, 37, place you want to visit, um, if, not my reservation, if it's, if I could visit someone, somewhere outside of the U.S., then I would want to go to Ireland, but within the U.S., I would love to go up to Wisconsin, um, to my reservation. Uh, 38, last place you were, the gym. Uh, 39, do you have a crush? The crush on my boyfriend, I guess. Um, 40, last time you kissed someone when my boyfriend was going to work. Last time you were insulted, a 41. Last time I was fucking insulted. I went on Snap and I vented about it and it was when some bitch tried to be like, when she said she wasn't full native, I was like, bye, please. Bitches. Um, 42, favorite flavor of sweet? Chocolate. Uh, 43, what instruments do you play? I don't play any instruments currently, Currently, but I used to play the flute in the end when I was in 6th grade. Uh, 44, favorite piece of jewelry? I don't have a particular favorite piece of jewelry, but I do like the diamond tops that I have for my nipple piercings that everyone always asks me where I got them from. If you're wondering, I got them from Industrial Strength. I bought them at the shop I was pierced at. I'm talking really fast because I'm trying to get through all of these because there's like a lot. <laughs> Sorry guys. Um, 45, last sport you played, I don't play sports, um, 46, last song you sang, I don't remember, truth, I don't really sing songs, that's not really who I am, um, 47, favorite chat upline, I don't, I don't know, uh, 48, have you ever used it, 49, last time you hung out with anyone, um, if my boyfriend doesn't count, then, Probably on the 4th of July. I'm not a very sociable person and I don't apparently have any friends anymore. Um, 50. Who should answer these questions next? And that's the last question. Alright, who should answer these questions next? Mm, my brother Eli. You guys can find his channel link down below. I always have a link down below. Um, along with a few other people's channels that I really enjoy. Um, I believe that they're all native. Native people. <laughs> Whatever. Yeah, I have those linked down below. Um, but yeah, so I want my brother to answer these questions. And anyone who wants to answer them, um, that'd be great. <laughs> but that is it. All I have for you guys today. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. And sorry that I'm just facey. I don't know. I'm just, like, when I don't film for a while, it's hard for me to get back into, like, filming. And so I'm, like, a little bit weird on camera. Um, so I apologize about that, guys. But this is it. Love you all. Thank you so much for watching my video and hopefully you'll check out my next one.